in the comments tell me something that you are working on let's help each other out let's keep each other focused let's spread some positivity to one another hi and welcome to my channel if you're new here my name is ty over here we talk about all things holistic health wellness self-care lifestyle and expression if you're into that go ahead and subscribe now i won't disappoint you and if you're a returning subscriber hey welcome back so the thoughts that have been on my mind lately they my thoughts have been more positive i love that moment in existence when you have the knowledge and then you start applying it especially when it comes to the mind like we all know the mind is a trickster we all know that when we when i say it's you versus you is really you versus your mind because your mind has these set patterns and beliefs and all of this stuff already programmed into it and here you are deciding that you want something different for your life and it's you are trying to deprogram and destroy these negative self-beliefs so i love a moment of like conquering that you know what i'm saying like today i caught myself i was like i i don't feel like recording like i i don't want to and the reason why i didn't want to is because i just don't feel like it right but i told myself in my monthly planning video i was like yeah i want to upload um a youtube video every week just so when people find me on youtube shorts shorts or on tiktok or instagram whatever they'll have some content to binge so i was like yeah i don't i just i don't feel like doing it i just you know i'd rather just lay here chill and scroll and i started to do that and then i was like oh no <laughs> whoa i was i caught myself because i was like here we go literally i was like here we go where where you're if you do this i was like if you do this you are literally um reinforcing the habit that you just said you wanted to get out of actually i like to call it a cycle Ooh, it's hot in here let me roll the window down a little bit let me get a little air in here i'm at the park i got me a little walkie walk in and i was like you know what? let me let me come talk to the girls but anyways and basically that cycle for me which i don't know if i talked about it in my other visual journals but that cycle is, is getting really excited about something doing the research doing the planning doing whatever the pre stuff is um and then doing it being consistent with it and completely falling off and i usually do that for several reasons but the main reason is usually because i don't feel like it no more right so um add the feeling of oh i don't feel like it in with the thoughts of like nobody really cares anyway it's nothing to drop it. it it'd be nothing to just drop it or be like oh i'll do it later or whatever and so i get to that point and then i start to feel like crap and being like well dang like i know i would be further if i would just stay consistent with it so then i get ex and then i'd be like all right this is what i'm gonna do and i get excited again and i start doing the research and the, pre the preparing and then i start doing the stuff and then i don't feel like doing it and then you know it's a cycle it never ends i was just i was literally just telling my homegirl i was like i i was on youtube back in the day you know what i'm saying like I was on YouTube, I want to say like 2017, 18 era, maybe even earlier than that. And if I would have just stayed consistent with it, I wouldn't be working as hard as I am now for the visibility because the content is there. The value is there. But with these platforms, you know, the first half of your journey is you fighting for visibility because don't nobody know who you are and nine times out of ten we're all selfish nobody cares who you are what can you provide so you know i was kind of beating myself up about that but you know we ended that conversation with now i know you know and just remembering that reinforces the fact of you just gotta keep going 
you learn from that lesson and you got to keep going and it doesn't feel good to be inconsistent because you always have that feeling of oh I would be further if I would have just things would look like this if I if I would have just like you know so I got up recorded um I want to do a digital detox next week so I pre-recorded some other stuff that will um hopefully sustain me throughout that week so I'm not feeling like I'm falling off of the face of the earth the digital earth um but I I need a digital detox I'm sorry like I'm not one of those people who can just constantly be on their phones because after a while I feel like crap and one thing I realized with content creation you spend the bulk of your time on the internet and um it just gets exhausting chill one thing i'm starting to become more confident with is not caring with people who are not in the fields or doing the things that i want to do gotta say like i post what i want to post but i'd be like damn i don't really want my friends to see it out and now i don't care baby i really don't care i it is what it is y'all know what i'm trying to do so if it's a little cringy then stop stop watching it but make sure you share it if a hater got something to say, that's fine. Just I just gotta focus on what my end goal is. It is what it is. And if the if you ain't benefiting it, you can't help me. You ain't got no constructive criticism. You don't got no words of affirmation. Then we ain't got nothing to talk about. Cheers to growth, because I wasn't always that type of person. I used to really care what people thought. I used to really hold people's opinion and and thoughts of me really high and that is slowly but surely getting lower and lower because i care more about what i think about myself and the work that i put out than anybody else especially if they ain't paying the bills <laughs> what if they ain't paying the bills or they ain't connected to a person who can pay the bills then i don't want to hear it it's cringy to you that's fine you're not paying the bills like it you're not the targeted audience obviously you know i absolutely love traveling to different states because the hits of inspiration that come over me is oh it feels so good my partner and I went to South Carolina, Charleston, and I just felt so inspired. And we even had a conversation about it. We kind of had a conversation about like having to go, like feeling like we need to go harder. <clears throat> and, um, you know, I kind of like mentioned the fact of like, yeah, you know, we can go harder, but we also need to work smarter. Because one thing I, that I realized as a person who has worked two jobs and went to school full time was living on her own like it was trying to balance the social life and family and all this other stuff you can go hard but you're going to be tired you're not going to be able to enjoy any of that and you know i was just telling him i want to work smarter i want to start getting that financial literacy and start learning about passive income and just making sure the things that i do are impactful and is going to get me to that end goal you know because we can work hard but you know we want we want to be able to sustain our energy levels so we can enjoy this the things that we're doing reap the benefits of it anyways let me get back to the point i always just feel so inspired and i'll be having all these ideas and i'm learning that i should write them all down in a you know just write them all down so i can visit them later because I, I don't have the energy to just do every single thing i really just like the vibe down there the people were friendly the sun was shining it was hot i loved it okay and it made me realize i really need to get the fuck up out of ohio immediately um because i didn't want to i didn't want to come back and that really just let me know like i'm ready you know sometimes like we'll say oh i'm ready to move i'm, I'm ready to move and then we have like all these feelings of like but i'm gonna miss my family and and what about da -da 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 -da? oh i really just love this part of the state though da -da -da -da. 
Child, I don't be having none of them feelings. Don't get me wrong. I'm going to miss my family. But my desire to get up out of here is way stronger. It is way stronger. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. But I really think I want to go to Houston. Now, I haven't visited Houston yet. But I just, I have a feeling. I don't know if, if you guys are familiar with Astro. Ooh, how you say it? Because I don't want to butcher it. Hold on. So it's called Astro Astro Cartography. And it's a map that shows you where the lines of certain planets in your chart lies, right? Where I'm living right now, y'all, basically um it's just it's really close to my north node look jupiter is right there jupiter is right there and mars isn't too far from it i like this map better because it actually is a little detailed mars isn't that far from it it's not that far from it but yeah i just i just feel like i would thrive there i need to get down there though I need to get down there so I can see what's up with the what's up. I just, yeah. And sometimes I tell myself, like, well, if you can't thrive here, you're not going to be able to thrive somewhere else. Sometimes we have to see ourselves as plants. And I've had many of plants who didn't do good in certain environments and certain containers. And you switch out the environment, you switch out the container, and here they are growing and thriving. And I see myself as a plant. I'm here and I'm growing, but I could be thriving somewhere else. You know, I make the best of where I am, but I want to be the best somewhere else. You know, like, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like today's visual journal, for the most part, was pretty positive. I just feel really optimistic. I feel like I believe in myself a lot more than I have in the past. Um... I feel more focused than I used to and like I said I'm just happy that I have those positive thoughts that come in and stop those negative thoughts because that's important yeah anyways I hope whoever is watching this have an amazing day um, if you stayed the entire time you are so awesome make sure you subscribe make sure you like and leave something in the comments i keep telling y'all this is a community i talk back to people so yeah leave it in the comments and i will see you all in my next video